Hello, it is Max Cullen here with my final IFB 102 project. For this project, I have built an electric guitar. To do this, I used the Raspberry Pi as well as a Adafruit capacitive touch sensor hat, which is that blue board you see that slides straight onto the GPIO pins and those these are uh, I guess you call them these rings or these holes in the board are sensors so if you touch those it can detect uh, yeah it can detect your touch uh, I've attached alligator clips to these sensors there's 12 12 of them and they go across the guitar to 20 cent coins which will act as the I guess the sensor so when the 20 cent coins are touched it will play a guitar sound uh, to do this, I downloaded the Adafruit libraries, which have the pre-built functions to use the sensors, and then I imported my own guitar sounds and created the option for users to swap between acoustic guitar and electric guitar sounds. So I'll demonstrate how to do that. Well, we'll run it. So you just uh, CD into guitar, which puts us in that directory. If we ls... There's the acoustic.py file, which just has the acoustic sounds, and then the guitar.py file, which is the main the main file that has all the, the commands and code in it, in it. Just a text file letting the user know to open guitar.py. So if we sudo python into guitar.py, we get a message saying, what mood are you in, electric or acoustic? Uh, we'll start off with electric and then go into acoustic, but we'll just type zero. It says, you have selected electric guitar, Max Collins Electric Guitar Project, N1108041, yada yada. And uh, I'll rock it out for you guys. Give me one sec. All right, so here's the front end of the guitar. Uh, as we saw, we have loaded the electric guitar sounds. So without further ado, time to play some music for you. We have a look at the computer here. It has all the chords that were strum and release as we press them. So if I press this one, the eight, uh, it says it's strummed, I'm about to release it. Boop, it says it's released. So it's just, that's cool. That's just showing the user what they've pressed. If we control C to keyboard interrupt, we can restart the file and select acoustic. So as you'd expect, I'm also going to show that to you. Alrighty, here we are with the acoustic guitar sounds now, and as expected. Not quite in tune, but yeah, it does it. Yeah, I think you get the point. Anyway, that's all. So that's the electric guitar mini project. Hope you guys enjoyed watching and yeah, see you later.